Hi everyone, it's Akila. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. And I'm so excited because Bloxburg has updated once again. And this now makes it version 0.11.6. So let's go ahead and read the update log because this is a pretty big one. First of all, they have added an RGB color wheel in build mode. And I'm so excited for this because I have made a concept for this in the past and it's finally here. So I'm really glad that the new development team is really hearing us out and listening to what we want. So the next thing is they added 11 new materials in build mode and I'm probably going to have a hard time telling which ones are new. I'm just being completely honest. So don't be mad in the comments. Don't do that because I'm really picky with which materials I use. I normally stick to the same ones. So if I get it mixed up, I get it mixed up. <laughs> the next thing are added solar panels that reduce your house bills. We have the ability to cut grass plants with weed trimmer or lawn mowers. There's added birds, butterflies, and bee effects to select objects. Is this a little hint that we might be seeing actual pets in Bloxburg this year? Possibly, possibly, but don't quote me on it. Don't quote me on it. Y'all are not gonna come back to me at the end of the year talking about we didn't get pets. It's not up to me. If it was, we would have been had them, but we'll see, we'll see. Okay, okay, moving on. Added new foods and ability to make jars of jam, fruits, and vegetables. I love a good food update, so I can't wait to see what these new foods look like. Added new plants and miscellaneous outdoor items. And last but not least, we have general animation improvements and major insect fixes. I'm a little confused because which insects did we have already? I don't know, but let's get into this color wheel because I know it's gonna be real cute. So let's hop into build mode. Okay, so right off the bat, I'm not seeing anything new but I'm guessing we're probably gonna have to go to our regular color palette icon. So let's click that. And I believe it's more off to the side. All of a sudden, whenever Bloxburg makes like changes to things we have had, I forget what it looked like in the past, but, and we do have this new icon right here. So if we click on it, we have this pop-up and it says color will access. Are you sure you want to buy this for 600 blocks bucks? And now we have our own little section down here. Oh my gosh, we have the ability to save our colors. Okay, let's just make our way around this color wheel because now we can have literally any color out there. This is insane, guys. Like the possibilities are endless. This is a really, really big change for Bloxburg and a really good one at that. Wow. And of course, you can like change the like shade or like the darkness of it. So if we scroll it all the way down, it goes all the way down to black and you can bring it back up so the color can be lighter. You can save 20 custom colors. Okay, now we're gonna try and spot all of the new um materials so right off the bat number one has to be this small square plaid i know for a fact that's new okay number two we have large leaves mowed grass lines okay so it's shaded so that's really cute i love the details um large flowers and small leaves so this is number five small flowers Seven, mode grass pattern. I think this is eight. This is the circular stone. This might be new. It might not be, because now it's looking real familiar, but I have no idea. But this is herringbone brick pavers, and that name is just not sticking out to me. So we're gonna consider it to be nine. So that means 10 has to be this new wood grain, which I'm gonna tell you now, you're gonna be seeing this a lot in my builds. And 11, this one, the wood deck tiles. I think, I think. Okay, but those are all the new materials and that's a wrap on the color wheel. So let's see what new items we have actually received in the build and decorate category. Okay, so this is build and new. So, Oh my goodness, 
this, we have a screen porch window and a screen porch door. This is gonna be so cute for summer builds. I mean, any build, but specifically summer builds. And we're coming up. We about to be outside, y'all. Okay, we also have the garden loppers. So, oh my goodness. They have to be placed against the wall. Okay, heading back to new. So this is what the screen porch window looks like. And this is what the screen porch door looks like. Oh my goodness, y'all. These are so freaking cute. And here are the garden loppers. Okay. We also have the garden hand cultivator, which goes on the ground or like just on a flat surface. Okay, that's what we're working with so far. Bridges. This is the garden um, stone garden bridge. This is the garden rope bridge. Hello, what the heck? Um, this is so cool. This is a cherry blossom tree. I don't know, something about to make my skin crawl. I think it's the texture. We also have a beehive house. There's bees, look at the bees! OMG, look at that. Shout out to the beehive. If you know, you know. This is the stacked stone fence, so let's just Let's just drag that right there. This is the round pole fence. So let's just put that back there. That is definitely very, very interesting. Okay, okay. This is the coiled garden hose. Love that. We have a bag of soil. A bag of soil. Is it big? <gasps> it is! Wow! And then there's this one that's standing, so we can put that against the wall. So I love that. I love that so, so much. There's also the Turf Trooper Weed Trimmer. Uh, we have berry bushes. Wait, why is it, why is it kind of cute? I know people are gonna have mixed feelings about it, and I get it, but something about it is cute to me. I don't know. Strawberries are my favorite. That is so cute. A tomato plant. Oh, we gonna be gardening, gardening. Okay, an onion plant. Oyong, an oyong plant. We have um, a hydrangea. I think it's hydrangea. Anyways, um, I have a mixed feeling about this one. We have a garden noob. This is so cute. Um, a fancy, there's more bridges. Okay, okay. We have the fancy garden bridge. It's giving very much a walk in the park, a botanical garden. They actually all are. Then we have the simple garden bridge. Lovely, lovely. This is an insect hotel. An Insect hotel. Do you see the bees? The little 2D bees? That's so cute. And the last thing here is a rose bush. Now, let's go to decorate because we do have a couple things in the decorate category. So, there's a welcome flower mat. Um, This is a flower pillow. Next. A food canning station. Wait, I want to put this like on the table or something. So I'm going to do that in a second. But we have a step ladder. This is a glowing landscape orb. Fortune teller vibes. But I like it. I like it. A bin of apples. OMG. But maybe we might actually get apple bobbing this year. I put a table down so we can add this little food canning station, just so we can see it a little bit better. And I think that's everything that's new besides the solar panels. Um, I know we can probably put these on a roof, possibly. We can. So we have, we can put it like right here. I think for now, just so we can take a better look at them, we're just gonna put a couple on the ground just so we can see them closer. And so basically this one's the cheapest one and this is the most expensive one. But I was told there was birds. 
So if we go to a birdhouse, right? Let's get a birdhouse. Let's put down a bird bath and the birdhouse. Wait, a butterfly! Yo! Yo, the butterfly is here! Hello! Oh my goodness! Wait, that was so cute! I thought it was literally just gonna be like the bees. Not that the bees aren't cute, but this is so detailed and it's flying away! Um, here are all the little bushes so we can harvest some roses. Look at that animation. Okay, we harvested the roses. We also have the tomatoes. So this is a new item. We have never had tomatoes. So we can eat it. Okay, so here are the seeds. We can take them. Okay, we can't put... Oh my gosh, the bird is in the birdhouse. Okay, so these are multi-use, which is good. And let's do it here. And that's a cute new little animation as well. And I guess we're just gonna wait again. <laughs> so, um, anyways, here's a closer look at the strawberries and the tomatoes. Oh my goodness, wait. Okay, so we can harvest them, we can store them. Let's just take one for now. And here we go. We can eat our little strawberry. And, okay, so you eat one and the whole thing just... The whole thing just goes away. Oh, you can bite the strawberry multiple times, though. Let's uh, take some berries. And we have, like, a little bundle of blueberries. This is a little gnome. We also have the onion. I almost forgot about that. Breath is gonna be funky. <gasps> There's a bird in the bird bath! Oh, my goodness. We can take this soil bag and just carry it around. It's literally as big as we are. Same for this one. You can carry it. And we can collect honey from... Oh! oh my... No, she didn't. No, we didn't. That is so cute. Like, it's in a little jar. I'm assuming the jam is gonna look like that too. We can take apples from this little... Um, bin of apples. We can turn this light on or off. We can take this. It's giving hashlinging slasher vibes. I just freaking dug a hole. Look! Y'all, we are really gardening. We, I told you, we are outside this year. <gasps> wow! That is so cool. There's this. We're trimming the bushes. I don't think it's really doing anything. Yeah, it's not. Because we can just do this, like, here. Uh, oh. Oh. Oh, get into it. Wait! Wait! Okay. Let's try it one more time on the short grass and the long grass. I don't know if it's gonna do anything. It- Okay, it does. It does. It gets rid of it. Okay, I love that. This is the- screen door and the new tree there's the fences as well show status efficiency 100 percent average efficiency 100 percent bill reduction 589 dollars my current bill is 2345 dollars so i think we checked out everything except for the canning station can we do anything with the tomato we can <gasps> What is it? What? Veg it's just something with vegetables. I don't know exactly what it is, but there's like a little like icon with vegetables. All right, so we're putting the apple in there and we're mixing it and we'll go and grab the strawberries next. So here's a look at our brand new jars. This is so detailed. So now we're gonna head inside and see what the new foods are. Okay, so we're in the kitchen and uh... First of all, let's just check quick meal before I forget. Uh, okay, so there's jelly toast. And it looks like that's it for quick meals. So let's go ahead and make some jelly toast. Let's go to this counter over here. It looks like the mixed berry pie is the only thing we can make. So, okay, so we have a couple berries on the little cutting board. So let's take that and cut all the stuff out. Up. Now let's just take all of our things and we're gonna enjoy them outside. Okay guys, we have a couple of our jams and we have our toast and mixed berry pie, which looks so delicious. 
But I really hope you enjoyed watching this video. Go ahead and let me know in the comments how many stars you rate this update out of 5. I would give it 5 out of 5 stars. But if you enjoyed this video, do not forget to leave a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below. Once you are subscribed, click the bell button so you get notified whenever I post a video. And with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Bye!